Awesome. Good taste in music. <laughs> um, um, my fans are incredible and they're just the real MVP, as one would say. Um, they support me through everything and in the world to me. MTV Artist to Watch was pretty cool, not gonna lie. Um, I was just thinking about the artists that have been there in the past, like Sam Smith, and then a year from then, seeing where he is now, it's just, it was an honor. <laughs> I got close enough to call him Schmendez, and it was socially accepted. That was pretty cool. His fans are pretty great, too. Um, they are <laughs> really intense in the best way possible, and I got to write some cool music with him, and just have a friend in the industry that is same age and normal, just like me, it was awesome. It's going to be a little bit left of center, and it's pretty much just going to be word vomit. Like, whatever comes out, I'm not really concerned about putting in a box or trying to define the genre. It's just going to be whatever comes out. boxing song it was like the lyrics were you pick me up to knock me down you stare at me until my head hits the ground it was very violent but you know it had a whole like boxing feel I pictured a music video in a boxing ring because that actually sets it's on so anyway that was that um well I have pretty uh random inspirations, just like different genres. I love Adele, I love Amy Winehouse, I love Eminem, I love Nirvana, um, I love Aretha, Nina Simone, Christina Aguilera, <laughs> um, yeah, so they're pretty much all over the place, but there are like certain things that I love about all of them. I <laughs> was sort of sought out by someone in the audience um, when I was performing back home and they were like, you should try out for The Voice. And I was like, okay, green big. Here I am now, like a year or two later and just being my own artist and my own person, it feels so great. And obviously I'm signed now to Atlantic and it's just all coming together and actually happening. <laughs>